Hello YouTube, how's everybody? This is Bob coming to you from beautiful Pig Wild Ranch. Beautiful spring day, late April. And uh, this country is still in the grips of the coronavirus and we're still in quarantine, but I'm definitely practicing social isolation as there's uh, nobody around here right now. I'm all alone here. I got my uh, target set at about 30 yards, 45 paces. I got Cougar's Butte behind me. And uh, today I have uh, three rifles to show you. These are my recent uh, pandemic panic buys. <laughs> of course, I've been uh, panic buying for the past uh, 41 years, starting from the police strike of New Orleans in uh, 1979. That's 41 years ago when I bought my first gun. Since I've been uh, living in California for the past 36 years, I've been in a perpetual panic given how uh, the latest latest uh, stands on uh, guns. Anyway, I have uh, three uh, rifles. They're all Rossi R92 lever action guns. Uh, of different barrel lengths and configuration, but they are all lever action. This one is uh, in a 44 Magnum, and it has a 24 inch barrel, octagonal barrel, as you can see. And the second one is in a 38 Special 357 Magnum. This one has a 20 inch barrel and has a barrel band, you see, different from an uh, end cap there. This is in uh, 357 Magnum. And the last one is a uh, 44 Magnum also. Now I'm gonna shoot a 357 Magnum. See how many rounds it loads. This is the first time I shot this gun. This is 357 Magnum. Okay, I'm shooting the 357 Magnum, 20 inch barrel. This is uh, not nearly as easy to load as the 44 Magnum. This is tight. Forgot the safety again. Man, I gotta remove that safety. Okay, this is better. Cycles well, and the size at least uh, is, looks seem to be accurate. Let's try some more. So I'm shooting the 38 Special Plus P. This one is uh, jacket hollow point. It's called uh, Winchester Ranger Plus P 38 Special. I got 12 rounds in the magazine. Let's see how it goes.
Okay, shoots pretty well. Let's try some uh, more 38, uh, 357 Magnum. These are Federal. 158 grain. Jacketed round nose. 357 Magnum. I got about seven rounds in there. Very difficult to load for some reason. Much easier to load the 38 Special Plus P. So I only got about seven rounds. It should hold more, but we'll see. I only had five rounds in there. <laughs> That's all I had seven. Empty. It's just hard to load for some reason. Maybe you'll get loose for after a while. Now we're gonna shoot the 44 Magnum with the 24 inch barrel, octagonal barrel. I got about 13 rounds of uh, 44 Magnum in there. This is a HSM 44 Magnum, 240 grains, plated flat point, plated flat point. I got my safety off, <laughs> don't forget that. Some of the couple around in the magazine didn't uh, didn't cycle for some reason. Let's see. So the last round uh, did not get uh, elevated, so it didn't get fed into the chamber. So now I got it. I find out I have to aim a little bit lower to get hit the target. So the sight may be a little off. It could be just me though. I'm not such a great shot, that's for sure. This time I'm gonna shoot the 44 Special. I don't know if you'll cycle, so I only load the six rounds. This is the one with a 26 inch octagonal barrel. This is 44 Special.
Well, surprisingly, it functioned pretty well with the 44 Special, so I'm going to try some more. Okay, I got uh, 13 rounds of 44 Special in the magazine now. Cycle every one of them. Pretty nice. I like it. Shoot, it's gonna be the 44 Magnum. Let me load it up. Loads very easy. Four. Five, six, okay, so I got A rounds in the, in the magazine. Rounds. Well, didn't do too well, but next one I'm gonna shoot is uh, 44 Special from uh, LAX Ammo. Let's see if it will chamber, if it will shoot. Okay, I barely got uh, 10 rounds of 44 Special in, 10 rounds. But in the future, I think I'll just load nine. <laughs> Didn't chamber. So uh, in conclusion, uh, these are pretty nice guns. They function very well. The only one that gave me trouble was this one. First of all, I can't hit a damn thing with it. Uh, number two, it gave me problems uh, feeding the 44 Special. So I'm gonna try some more 44 Special. I got what six rounds in here. That's the last try, last chance. Chamber. One didn't chamber. <laughs> the side was definitely off. B 
because I, I was aiming about uh, six inches away from the outside of the target, six inches, and I was able to hit them. So uh, I got to adjust the sight when I go home. But this time it functioned pretty good with the 44 Special, except one that didn't, uh, didn't get chambered. So it's not so reliable with 44 Special. But with 44 Magnum, pretty damn good. One more chance with this 16-inch uh, barrel, 44 Magnum. I got nine rounds of 44 Magnum in there. Let's see if I, if I can hit anything. Now I know I have to aim about six inches to the to the left. Well, cycle a while, but I still can't hear anything. So, I was doing okay with my other gun, so I don't think it was completely me. So, the sight is definitely off on this one. I gotta go home and adjust it using my uh, laser bore sighter. Anyway, that was fun. Gotta, ch gotta try out all three guns. Only one that gave me some problem was this one. Thank you all for watching.